so what I was managed to do today with the tiny house that I'm building um, managed to get to get the sink in place faucet soap dispenser I did a hot water heater it's too dark to see it it's in the cabinet there 12 gallon I opted for a six gallon but I got a good deal on a 12 so I stepped it up figured it'd be better for showers um carried the that's actually flooring the like the floating flooring I glued and nailed it with a nail gun up to the wall there to match what I got going on here with the kitchen uh, I gotta finish the top cabinets which I plan to do soon I'm also gonna take that same design and carry it over here to the closet as I've posted in other videos this here is pallets that I've disassembled and, and nailed um, I'm gonna do the same thing here with that I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do up here I might do the pallet wood just continue it up to the ceiling I got R19 insulation on the ceilings um, <laughs> I know it's kind of odd but I got this like burgundy red tin mixed in with the other tin that I got for the stove it ended up that way because I got it for free and you can't turn turn down free material so I may paint it not sure what I'm gonna do with it swung an elbow today on the stove because I didn't like how close the stove was to the walls the walls were getting really super hot and uh, you know I don't want all the work that I've done to go up in flames so I stepped that out it's a good six inches more away from the walls and they are staying considerably cooler again I got the pallet wood there uh, the refridge will go there pallet material here as well then you step into what's going to be the bedroom and it's just basically OSB board I get it pretty cheap um, I'm going to put some batten strips lattice strips over all the seams and then paint this put like Luan or something on the ceiling and uh, that'll be at the bedroom did a lot of work in the bathroom today put tin down here at the bottom the sink is obviously going to go here and toilet and then I get these they're they're called uh, kickers I just take them out when, where I work I take them out from underneath uh, the lumber and um, ended up tacking them up to the wall there I'm going to sand them put a like, clear finish on them but I trimmed out the window and then I got the panel in here and the FRP board on the top showers in uh, really pleased actually with what I did inside the shower I got some hook up on some tin and uh, I did tin inside the shower now all I gotta do is get a trim kit for my faucet and you know the shower is done to be able to take a shower caulk it in it'll be good so plan on carrying what I did over here over into this corner and then put the same paneling here that's on this wall so I got a switch here it runs a fan draws heat from the fireplace into the bedroom and the bathroom obviously that's the light so overall I had a very productive day very pleased with what I accomplished so I'll post more videos as I go along hopefully get all this done tomorrow that's my goal I want to get this whole wall done in tomorrow peace